everyone, welcome back to the NASCAR Thunder Toss Week career for Race 33 of 36, Season 5 of the Creeper Corner with Atlanta. I'm not looking forward to this race, but thankfully, we got a 612 point gap over Jeff Gordon. And Junior, he did horrible in Lawrenceville, but he's only four points behind Gordon. So, I'm comfortable to I'm not going to do well in Atlanta. I know I, know I won't, but we're going to do it with the best stuff possible. So, we're probably going to do bad, but I haven't shown you these yet, but here it is. And no more upgrades. And uh, let's get this race over with. Let's see, we start ninth. Wow. All right. I'm scared about the race because I know I'm not going to do well, but surprisingly, we got a good qualifying run. But then the quit. The other question is the race. How long am I gonna do in the actual race? That's gonna be the big question. But the final time on the Atlanta. We're live from the Atlanta Motor Speedway in Hampton, Georgia, for today's Napa 500 on MRN. I expect to see some exciting racing in this one, don't you, Barney? The high speeds that can be reached here does make for some exciting racing. There's no restrictor plates to keep them from being able to pass either. It's just all-out, flat, good old stock car racing with the best drivers in the business. I can't wait to get this one underway. The Coca-Cola car is showing the importance of consistency this year. Well, points, points, points. Wins are great when they come, but top ten finishes week after week are what build your points. Heck, you could win the championship on top tens alone if you're consistent. Bobby Hamilton is having some trouble in the points this year. And, of course, nobody wants to be on the bottom of that points list. He'll have to work extra hard to pick up spots. Not an easy task to dig yourself out of a hole in this series. Ken Patterson is towards the bottom of the points list this season. And how frustrating that must be. You're working just as hard as everyone else, yet you just can't seem to finish well on race days to gain the valuable points you need. These guys need a good finish just to regain their confidence as a team. For the land of the free Jimmy Johnson in this custom car in the front row. Let's get this shit show underway. And the final time in his career. Run away in Atlanta! And yeah, I'm going to this with the best rate with the best rate car, so we'll see how well we do here with the best stuff. Probably bad, but you never know. I don't know where I'm gonna finish because. I know I'm going to lose a lot of points. This is not my best try, like I mentioned so many times. And there's that random bump. I'm sorry. Oh, jeez. Yep. Yeah. Oh, God. The question is where I finish. We're going to be back to 10th. So we lost the spot. We'll see where we finish here. Like I mentioned so many times, this is my worst track. They're going about 185 in the corner, I assume, so... And like I anticipate, I'm going to lose a lot of points, but thankfully we have a big point lead. We have about a 612 point lead, and I just botched it. Sorry, bro, I did not mean to do that. in the middle, three wide. And you're almost killing me. Bump. No. This is my worst track game to go about the doing heat five shit in this game. Oh shit. In this game, could you they're doing heat five shit. So you're almost going wide open and I can't. They're going wide open. gonna get a good finish. I know we're not, but we haven't come to the point lead, so I'll be alright. We have about three race lead, so I'm probably gonna lose a, a full race of the points, but I'm so... I'm four, four one! 
were full wide at one point at the 20th after my lovely ninth place starting spot. Yeah, I swear, they gotta go 185 in the corner. The Thunder, I'll be better, I'll be better here at Thunder 04, guys, I promise. Thunder 04, yes, it's gonna be the next career. Sorry, Rusty! In, but not this one! Y'all got to hold me out because I'm still keeping up with them. On the straight west, but in the corners, they're going wild, but in the corner, I'm not. They're doing NASCAR Heat Today stuff. Not the old Heat games, today's Heat games suck. That's why I can't wait for the next, the next game to come because I don't even really go wild, but in the corner anymore. But I bet, in that game, they're still gonna go wild into the fucking corner. They're doing E5 shit. That's exactly what they're doing. You get out of the way, tail booty! Chief. I'm so keen to have a guy in front of me. I get, I get a lot of straightaway speed, that's why I'm keeping up with them. It all grades in, and I'm still struggling. Thanks, crew chief. Stuff to where I'm fucking struggling at this 
three point range. Thanks for letting me know, crew chief. I'm not gonna get max points. I think Gordon and Jr. are probably gonna win this race. I'm gonna stay out as long as I can. I hope to get a caution. It might be the best call. Yeah. I hand to turn one, I'm gonna put this time. This is nothing's happening, I'm gonna this big old run, run. Yeah, nothing's happening at this track as always. I'll let Kurt have the outside because I'm gonna pit. I'm gonna go for four tires of fuel. Maybe, get, maybe the crew give me a fast stop. I don't know. My aggressive. All right, beautiful. Four tires of fuel. Have the wedge out, and let's see what happens here on the stop. Slow stop. Yeah, I lost the SHW. You know, you know, girl, I'll accept the bad stock because this is my worst track. You know, I'll, I'll accept it. I'll be okay with this bad stuff. Just don't get. Don't. Oh, I got the page. Game? I, I have a page tear the booty. I'm sorry. Game? Don't blame me. Blame tear the body because he was the one that will page me. So, yeah. Don't blame me. Blame the body, because he's the one who pays me. He's the one that pays me. I'm trying so hard, crew chief. Alright, thanks for letting me know, crew chief. Chief, let me know I'm clear. Sorry about it. Almost got split in the middle. Oh, jeez. My bad. <laughs> I'm sorry. Shut up, crew chief. I don't care. I don't care. I just can't wait for this race to end because this will be the final time coming here. Now I got to come to a point that I'm going to lose that lead. Cushion do it, so that's no job. I can keep up with these guys on straight lines, but out in the corner. I can keep up with them on, on straights. So I blow up right in front of me. Let's see who it is. It is Ashton Lewis. Okay. around Atlanta. Still here on the 27th. Done tapping. Sorry I was quiet because I just hate this place. With very passion. Lost another spot. We'll see if I can hit on the 28th. I'm going to say, I'm just excited that this race to the end because I hate this track. Well, at least for the career, it's been my final time coming here. All right, can I hit on the 28th? I don't know. <laughs> Final lap around at Lamar Speedway. Thankfully, I had a big point lead going to this because I knew this was going to be my worst race in this final stretch. Heading down the back straightaway. Heading down to turn three. 
Should I can hear him in the spot, hear the free clip up? No. Let's see if I can finish. Alright, looks like 29. Yeah, 29 is all I'm gonna get. Thank God. This race is over. And Dale Jarrett won. Okay, Junior finished second. He's gonna gain a lot of points on me. I know he will. Not a single caution lap was run in the whole race. I was happy. Thanks, Joe Moore, for that. I think Junior probably let a lot of Junior did. Where did Gordon finish? Gordon finished. Let's see, Gordon finished. An eighth. Didn't lead a lot. I think Junior did. Let's see. No, Junior didn't lead a lot. So we got 170 points. Yeah, Junior's. It, my lead's gonna go down for sure. Yeah, so. We'll be right back. Oops. This is rocking him, and let's see how big our point lead is. 524. So that's almost. That's gonna be. Um, 88 points, I believe. Let me do the calculations. Yep, 88 points! Thankfully, I had that big of a point lead in case that happens. And yeah, going to the, the final two, the next two races, I'll be okay. It looks like this will be my last season, so. They are going to rock and hammer. I won there last time, so we'll see how well we do this time. So anyway, I'll see you all at Rock and Ham. And as always, have a good day, everyone.